Hello and welcome. Hello, this is Jack Snyder on one, and welcome to part six of my PC build series. And in this series, in this part, I'm going to show you how to install the disk drive. Now, in this case, as I'm pretty sure, actually, in every case, the disk drive goes here, and some of them have maybe six or eight disk drive slots. So this one only has two. So the first thing I did was to remove the front fascia from the front of the case or the little port where the disk drive goes in so I'll take you around to show you that just here, you can see here removed it and here it is here so I'll remove that and now I'm going to slot the disk drive into the case from the front and then secure the two screws. Now this is not sensitive to static electricity as such but because I can I'm going to use the static wrist strap. So get the hard uh, get the disk drive and for this project I'm using a light on DVD rewriter 24 times multi recorder which was quite cheap but a good drive all the same so make sure it's the right way up as you can see here and we'll slide it backwards into the case until there's some slight resistance on here so get that in and we make sure it's flush with the front of the case or wherever you desire it to be and then that is in like that and let's take the camera quickly off so I can just show you inside the case but that is in there and also the screw holes line up so we'll just at the minute I only have two screws I do recommend you use four screws but because I've run out I've only got two so I'm going to put one on each side just on the safe side so this one I'll put on the back for argument's sake and I actually think I have the wrong screws Sorry about that, I actually found out that I had the wrong screws for this disk drive because it takes different screws to the hard drive, which I don't think it would. That's another thing you've got to be careful of when you put your components in to make sure you use the right screws. So because these are different screws, I do actually have four of them. So as recommended, I can put in, by myself, I can put in all four screws. So two on this side. Hold it in place, don't over tighten them as with most of the components in the computer. Come around here once again, the same with the hard drive, sorry you can't see this. But all I'm doing is installing the screws exactly the same as on the other side, but in this side. So if I can start the screw, put one screw in, tight but not over tight, and then the second screw in. Tighten them over tight and then just make sure they're fairly tight so it won't come out. Because although we don't want it to be over tight, we also don't want it to be coming out when it's vibrating around. So, once again, like the hard drive video, quite a short video, but I wanted to make sure it was documented correctly so that you know exactly what we're doing. So, I'll just show you in here. We've got the DVD in, got two screws on this side. It's flush with the front, and we've also got the two screws on the other side. So thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you in part 7.